Hi guys, this is a short tutorial to show you how to install Zoom Meetings app on macOS. So before we start, we have to allow to install applications from outside the App Store. So to do that, go to the Mac menu in the top corner, select System Preferences, here go to Security and Privacy, and here under Allow Apps Downloaded From, you have to select App Store and Identify Developers. To change the settings, you have to click on the lock here. Now you have to enter your password. And now you can select this option. Leave it open because you will need to access it in a minute again. So when you changed it, you can go to download the Zoom meeting app. To download the app, go to zoom.us. Here on the website, scroll to the bottom. And here under download section, select meetings client. And the first one here, click download. As you can see, the Zoom package file is downloading. When the file is downloaded, double click it to start the installation. And now click continue, install, provide your password. and continue with the installation. In some cases, you might be prompted that the application was blocked because the developer is unknown. And then you have to come back to security and privacy. You ha will have information here with allow button. And then you have to click allow and should be able to continue. As you can see, the Zoom application started. To join a meeting, you don't need to have an account. You can just join a meeting and paste the URL that you have. Also, please note that if you don't have the application installed and you get the URL and try to access it, you should be prompted from your browser anyway to download and install the application first. So you can also download it that way. If you want to host meetings, you have to have an account and sign in to do so. But this we will cover in a separate video. As you can see, when you click join meeting, you have to provide meeting ID or personal link name, enter your name, and then you can join the meeting. You also have to give access to the application to the microphone and camera. And then you can continue and join the meeting. I hope this was helpful, if yes, please hit the like button. And as mentioned, the further setup and how to host a meeting will be covered in a separate video. Thank you for watching and see you in the next one.